It's obviously natural. She'll miss another one. And Tom, the one thing I'm seeing with her free throw, it looks like she jumps a little bit. Yeah, Ryan, she, she, her mechanics are very... Unorthodox. Yes, but as, as, a, as a big man, you know, if you want to go back to the Shaq day, Shaq changed his, his free throw mechanics almost, it seemed, every year as Cooper takes her second shot and it is off the back iron. Marauders will get a break there. Seven straight misses by Cooper. She'll check out of the game, and I think that's a good move by Flegg because I think that she could sense that UVA Wise was gonna start, you know, like we said, using the old hack of shack Agreed. on Cooper. Cooper is one for eight from the free throw line today. Reimer with the drive. The pass just gets away. She was looking for the back door there on Martin. Harding's been automatic from three. The Cavs will definitely look to get her the ball from downtown if they want to mount a comeback here. Harding for three. Just misses that one. Reimer couldn't get the rebound. And a foul on the Marauders. That, that's a good foul right there by uh, number 14, Courtney Hennett. Right now, at this point in the game, under four minutes left, you're going to want to make the other team earn their foul shots. As you see here on the replay, the foul by Hennett. And now there's three minutes, 58 seconds left in the game as we go to the fourth and final media timeout of the second half. The Marauders lead 61 to 50. When we come back, we will see if the Marauders can hold off the comeback by the Cavaliers. Cavaliers will start at the free throw line. They're now in the double bonus. Free throw is knocked down by ball. She got fouled on the rebounding attempt. Reimer was not in good position. She did not box her out. And Hennett eventually picked up the foul. Marauders up nine, under four to go. They should use all that shot clock. And we have an offensive foul there, Tom. Did you see anything on that? No, I really didn't, Ryan. I think that was that was just kind of an iffy call there by the referee. Reimer now with three fouls. Not a lot of time left, so she should be good to stay in this one without fouling out. Dockery with the ball. Wild shot. And the Cavs will keep the ball. Rotter fans not liking that call. See on the replay there, you couldn't really see who touched that last. Another wild shot. This one will go in. Taylor Sandage knocks that one down. Reimer the handoff. Gallagher to Martin. Gallagher looking for the ball in the post. She will be fouled by ball. So Gallagher will go to the line. She's been their best free throw shooter today. She has 25 points. And this could come down to a free throw shooting contest down the stretch. Yeah, Ryan, I believe it will, honestly, with both teams in the double bonus this late in the game. With that make, Gallagher is six for six from the foul line. That's what the Marauders need to finish this game off and get the W. Marauders shooting 56% from the free throw line, but a lot of that has been Cooper's struggles. That one just rolls out. But Gallagher six to seven, very respectable from the line. Ball, nice pass, she'll finish. All of a sudden, only a six point game, Tom. Marauders need a Calm down a little bit on offense. They're, they're okay. They're in a position right now. They're, they don't have to come back. They can look for the good shot. As the foul there 
is on Allison Ball.